This call may be monitored or recorded for quality assurance purposes. We run, we run. Mm-hmm. Okay, you are from Ohio. Just, just uh, let me. Okay, uh, we run all through. Uh, we run uh, all forty-eight states, but we are focused on Midwest and Southeast. Welcome back, drivers, to the Recruiter Call Channel. And in this MTC, we're going to be looking at Leader Freight Systems out of Illinois. But let me let me just dial this back just a little bit because the young lady did say in the call that this was an Illinois company. But as I look it up online and try to do the background on it, I came across a safer score for leader freight systems now i'm not sure if this is the main company or a company that is recruiting for multiple companies as you guys will hear in the call because she did mention that they do have sister companies that's connected on to this call uh to this company so this is Leader Freight Systems out of Indianapolis, Indiana. So is that the right company? I don't know. You say Leader Freight Systems out of yeah. Illinois. So is this yeah. a, is this a 1099 company? Yeah. 1099 yeah 1099 okay so what what you yeah. guys what what you guys got to offer uh are you a company driver uh yes i am currently okay for company driver we can pay for dry van from 65 to 70 cents per mile okay for flatbed from 70 to 75 cents per mile and we can provide you 3000 miles per week you you say uh dry van is 60 to 65 how do i get to 65 no no i i told you 65 to 70 oh, okay I'm, I'm sorry i'm sorry so how how do i get to 70 <laughs> i'm sorry about that how, how do i get um, to 70 it depends it depends uh, on the company because we have some offer from with our sister company so uh when i check uh, where the trucks available in this moment i will tell you that Oh, okay. So, so you, so you, you're a recruiter for multiple, multiple yeah. companies. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, but I'm the recruiter, name, yeah. but but the name of the but the name of the company that you're recruiting for is Leader, right? Or is that's the name of the recruiting? Yeah, company? but yeah, but we have some some sister company. Uh, so, I will find uh, you something uh, there. You know, I will do my best to find something great for you. Okay, so as of so as of right now, as of right now, you only have you you only have to offer seventy or you you say sixty to seventy cent, right? So within yeah. with within the sister companies, that's where I can I can garner seventy cent. Uh, just. Okay. Just let me check that. Okay. Oh, okay. Go. Okay. Go ahead. Uh, just let me check uh, my list. So be there for a minute, please. Okay. Thank you. Cream? No, thank you. I take it black, like my man. So, sir, I just check some com our sister company, so I can tell you that would be Magnum Freight. Okay, so Magnum Freight would yeah. be would be the company that I can jump on and get seventy cent a mile at ten ninety yeah. at at ten ninety nine yeah. company. Yeah, ten ninety nine oh. company. Okay, so oh okay, so let's uh so Matt uh Matt Maxim, Matt, Maximum Freight. Am I pronouncing that right? Yes, no. Yeah, that's a maximum because the the market is so bad now, now you know, and uh, that's the maximum we can provide you at this moment. Okay, okay, but the name of the but the name of the sister company is Maximum Freight, though, right? 
No, no, no. no, no Magnum no. Freight. Oh, Magnum. I'm I'm sorry. Like the condom. Magnum. <laughs> My fault. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> okay. Okay. So yeah. uh, so seventy. So seventy cent per mile. Uh, ten ninety nine. So that means I will be responsible. Yeah. I, I will be responsible for all benefits, all, uh, all, uh, uh, medical, dental, and all that other good stuff, right? Yeah. Uh, yeah. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Would That's I right. would, would I be any would I be responsible for any type of payment on the truck? No. Oh. Okay. Because that uh, that is a company driver position. Oh. Okay. As I told you. Okay. Okay. Very good. Very good. Now you did so, mention you mm -hmm. you did mention something about three thousand miles, which you know sometimes I equate yeah. sometimes I equate three thousand miles as as all the recruiters go to thing as far as you know as far as getting the miles out there. So I equate uh, mm -hmm. the maximum that that would be the maximum, but the minimum amount of miles would be anywhere between twenty five and twenty eight though for real, right? I think so. <laughs> okay, okay. So with that said, would this be like uh over the road the entire 48 or would this be like from a lane from Chicago to like Texas or or a lane from like you know Chicago to like Florida? I'm from Ohio. So. Yeah, we run we run mm -hmm, okay, you are from Ohio. Just just uh let me Okay, uh, we run all through, uh, we run uh, all 48 states, but we are focused on Midwest and Southeast. So. New York, no New York State, no New York City, Delaware, nothing in that corner of the world. Yeah. So can you tell me uh, how long you can usually stay out? on the road uh i well me i i prefer uh being that the type mm -hmm. of that the type of runs you just mentioned you know midwest and southeast i prefer to be home mm -hmm. on the weekends on a weekend that's that's a regional position original uh, because for over the road driver we require minimum two weeks on the road so you're from ohio and um, I can check uh, if we have some regional position for Ohio. And uh, if I find something, I will call you back. Oh, okay. Um, okay. So, so you don't have no, you don't have no regional position now through Matt and I Freight? don't know. Um, uh, no, with Magnum Freight we we don't have. Uh, Magnum Freight works uh, just with uh, over the road drivers. So uh, for a regional position, I'm I'm hearing what you're saying as far as regional goes. But you already said that the lanes is Midwest and Southeast. Yeah. So <laughs> that's yeah. That can be because that can be curtailed as as regional because Midwest is like Ohio. Indiana. Yeah, Chicago. I know, sir, but that's the rules. Yeah, I know, sir, but that's the rules of the company, you know. Uh, so, as I told you, for over the road driver, we can require we require a minimum two weeks. But if you want to go home every weekend, that would be a regional position. All right. So let me ask you this: So, if I decided to come home every two every two weeks, what's what's my home time like? Uh, from three to four days. Okay, so for three to four day, I'm out for two weeks, and I'm I'm home for three for four days. Can I can can I can I? Well, let me ask you this: What kind of equipment that I will be driving, and can I take it home? Uh, you can take uh, the truck home uh, for equipment. We have. Uh, Trucks full equipped uh, for, with fridge, uh, microwave, inverter, APU. What is it? A Volvo or Freightliner, Peterbilt? What 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 equipment? We have we have international Freightliner, Cascadia, Canvert, Volvo. Oh, y'all have y'all have a mixture. Okay, so now let me ah. ask you this: Now, if I decide to come on come aboard and get in one of those trucks. 
Would that mean what you I know? would? Would that mean I would get like a newer model truck that would be assigned to me, or would that be a truck that somebody else have and that'll be assigned to me? You can see that with the boss of the company if you apply with us. I don't know the 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 rules of uh, that company, as I told you. So if you want to apply, the application go goes through me. I will do uh, that for you. So I uh, have any questions for you as um, how much experience do you have? Uh, I, got a, I got about seven years of experience. Is there... Seven. Is, yes, ma'am. Mm -hmm. is, is there a sign-on bonus? No, we don't have sign on bonus. Okay, no 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 sign on bonus. Uh yeah. if I have a buddy, if if I have a well, I do got a buddy actually. I <laughs> ain't no if, but team I, drivers, right? Well, no, he's well, he could be he could be a, either a team or a solo driver, but if I do have a buddy that that might be interested in coming on coming aboard, uh is there oh, is yeah. there a way that it, 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 he's like brand new out of school, so how many how many years do do you guys require uh, for experience? Because uh, for team drivers, it would be okay if you have seven years uh, experience. Uh, for him, one month or two months, uh, it's not uh, it's not a problem. Okay, what about if what, what, he, what if what if what if he want to drive solo though? For solo at this moment, for that experience we don't have a position okay 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 but what what would be the what would be the experience that you guys are looking for like what a year two years um, 18 months at minimum minimum one year sir minimum okay okay well you know what thank you very much i really do appreciate the call i do have one last question though uh i do mm -hmm. have I, I do have another driver buddy that that had <clears throat> issues with uh with the clearing house um mm -hmm. and he's just now getting everything taken care of through the clearing house do you guys do you guys bring he has about he has about a year year and a half experience so that shouldn't be too much of a problem but do you guys hire hire sap uh program drivers from the clearing house so I don't know. You can give him my number, and uh, if he call me, I will do my best to find something. But I can't. Uh, I can't uh, say that for sure. Okay. Very good. Very good. Okay. Uh, okay. All right. So the company that uh, that 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 matches me is Magnum Freight. And yeah. This would be yeah. this would be the same company out of Chicago as well, right? Yeah. All right, 1099, 1099, 70 yeah. cent, uh 70 cent anywhere between anywhere up to like 3000 miles and you require me to be out for about 2 for about 2 weeks yeah. and then I'll be home for like yeah. 3 days and I'll be able to take the truck home. All right, very good, ma'am. Thank yeah. you very much. I really do appreciate the call. Another Chicago land company out of Illinois, 1099. Uh, sound like they got a number of trucks. Uh, I'm not sure whether or not you'll be put in a new one, in a new truck or so, but uh, if that's the case, you should always ask, like, what, what type of truck that you probably might end up getting, going into. Because a lot of these trucks is like rehash, reuse, remodel, refits, repurpose, and all like that. Let's say, for example, you get out of somebody had animals like cats, dogs, pigs, whatever, whatever. And you end up taking, taking that truck without even knowing all of that shit was in there until you start deep diving into the, tr into the truck itself and you started noticing you know, mildew smells and stuff like that, and you're supposed to end up getting a new truck. But instead, you get a a, 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 a 20 garbage, you know, a, a, a 20 some 20 garbage, and you end up being in a truck that's going to be broke down. 
You're not going to be able to make no kind of money. You're going to be sitting. You're going to be waiting. Your truck is going to be in the shop for whatever the case. So you should always need to know what type of equipment that you're going to get into because the equipment, not, you know, everything is important, right? Everything is important. Everything is for everything important from making the money, getting the miles, getting the home time. But the truck is also important too, because if you, if you get a lemon, then you're not getting the money, you're not getting home and you're not getting the miles. It all works in a plan. So uh, if you're interested, they do have regional positions, but I, I don't believe that they have any regional positions, which I, I kind of find it weird that she says that they don't have regional positions because the Midwest and Southeast are regional positions. So why wouldn't I be able to get home every weekend? I'm, I'm from Ohio, so I could do everything from Minnesota all the way down to Ohio and still get home, get home at the end of the week. I could do everything from Ohio all the way down to Florida and still get home within the week. Cool. This coffee smells like shit. I, I don't understand that. I mean, if it's, you know, how is Southeast and... And in and, and Midwest, how is that over the road? Well, of course, it's, it's over the road, but it's still considered regional, though. But, um, Magnum. Damn, I, I, I forgot the initial company already that she, uh, that she called from. But both of these companies are out of uh, Chicago, uh, Chicagoland area guys know about black ops so this probably might be a foreign company and i'm i'm not beating down the i'm not beating down the block on on foreign companies though for real for real uh if you're a driver that has some issues you know them them type of companies might be able to help you out of the situation that you're in uh definitely if you're in the clearinghouse situation definitely find out a little bit more about that because I heard through the grapevine that some of them companies will overlook that, which they're not supposed to, but who knows? You know, you, you need a job, you need to start making money, you need to start paying bills. So these blackout companies out of Chicagoland area will probably help you out, so. All right, you guys, uh, let me know what you think about the call. Leave your comments in the comments below. If you have, if you drove or driven or drive for this pump particular company, let us know your experience with them. Who's next? Who's next?